first walked by this building on 210 West 14th Street in February of 2019. I was researching the life of Marcel Duchamp in New York. I knew he had a studio on the fifth floor, and as I arrived I was surprised that the building has no plaque on it. Not a word that one of the geniuses of the 20th century art world worked in this building. I returned to New York in the summer and I was taking photographs of the building when the third floor tenant noticed me and invited me to look around. That is when I made these photos, walked up to the fifth floor and stood in front of the apartment Duchamp rented. Based on the postcard glued to the door, you can tell that the current tenant knows who lived there before. I decided to make a memory plaque for Duchamp and with the help of the tenant who let me in, I contacted the owner of the building. My idea was quickly turned down because I was told tourists would be standing outside of the building and that is a disruption the house doesn't want. I still wanted to create the plaque, but now it should be unnoticeable, a hidden treasure for only those who know about it. The idea came from Duchamp's last masterpiece that he created in this building. Etan Denis, a three-dimensional artwork you can only look at through peepholes drilled through a door. So my project began. I bought electric appliance boxes and decided to put the plaque inside. I made this drawing of Duchamp based on one of the photographs of his door and the hallway. I imagined him losing his keys and sitting on the steps waiting for help. I printed the drawing with a few words on metal and place it inside the box. You can view the tiny plaque through a magnified viewfinder. Had to color match the gray paint so the plaque blends in completely. I mounted the plaque on the left side of the building. Then I just walked on as nothing happened. Now you know the secret. Check out the plaque and pass this on to those who like Duchamp's work and would like to peep into this hall.